the quaint town of Ferndale in Humboldt County is not only known for its colorful Victorian architecture, but it's also the starting point for one of Northern California's most scenic drives. Matol Road is certainly not for the faint of heart. It's a bumpy, windy road through some of the most undeveloped land in the state of California. There's a reason this region has been named the Lost Coast. As Ralph Waldo Emerson said, life is a journey, not a destination. And we would argue that the same is true for Matol Road, because the truth is, there really is no destination. The journey itself is the main attraction. When we started the drive, we were nervous that the summer coastal fog would ruin the views, but it only added to the intrigue of this little known road trip, and thankfully only stayed with us in the higher elevations. It felt as if we were driving through the clouds. Many of the panoramic views of green rolling hills and rugged coastline reminded us of one of our favorite countries, the Emerald Isle of Ireland. You'll pass through farmland and the tiny town of Cape Town as you wind your way down to the coast. After about an hour of driving, we finally laid eyes on the Pacific. The coastline is embellished with a scattering of massive rocks. We practically had this entire region to ourselves. Within an hour's time, we'd pass no more than five cars. We'd stop often, breathing in the fresh air and taking in the views. After about a seven mile stretch along the coast, the road turned inland and the views once again became rolling hills as far as the eye could see as we traveled through Matol Valley and the town of Petrolia. There is one detour off the main route that we highly recommend. Hang a right on Lighthouse Road and get ready for a bumpy ride as you navigate the unpaved path down to where the Matol River ends and empties into the Pacific Ocean. There's a campground at the end of this four and a half mile dirt road. It fills up on a first come first serve basis and primarily caters to adventurous hikers making their way along the Lost Coast Trail, a 25 mile hike that goes along the rugged coastline of the King's Range Wilderness. We 
parked our car in the small parking lot and set out to explore just a small version of this epic trail along Matoll Beach. We couldn't believe that we had this entire gorgeous place all to ourselves. Once back on the main route, the road got windy. Very windy. If you're prone to motion sickness, you might want to consider some remedies. Otherwise, just take it slow and use the pullouts to stop and enjoy the views. The road continues to wind as you make your way into Humboldt Redwood State Park, a fitting ending to a seriously stunning drive. Now you're amongst some of the tallest trees in the world. There are plenty of great places to hike under the canopy of redwoods. So after that awesome drive, you might want to save it for another day. 